Hey DIYers! Someone just gave me a set of mismatched glassware and I went a little crazy experimenting with it. I came up with something that is a mix between the holy grail and a goblet at a renaissance fair. But I kind of love the way they look. I used colorful glass chips, dazzle it, aluminum wire from John Bede, I love this stuff, and we put it all together with E6000 glue. And the best part about these pieces is that they're washable. Remember to thumbs up if you like this project and leave me a comment if you have a question about this video or you just want to say hello. And you know how much I love it when you stop by and say hello. Are you ready? Let's make some glorious goblets. Simple drinking vessels made from pottery were used from about 4500 to 3500 BC. During the Bronze Age, 2500 to 1500 BC, metalworking techniques were introduced and developed, resulting in items being crafted out of bronze and gold. There is a difference between a goblet and a chalice. A goblet is a drinking vessel with a foot and stem, while a chalice is a large drinking cup, often having a stem and a base and used especially for formal occasions and religious ceremonies. Medieval history lecturer Margarita Torres and art historian Jose Miguel Ortega del Rio claim the Holy Grail rests inside the Basilica of San Isidoro in the northern Spanish city of Leon. These fancy vessels would be perfect for a party where everyone forgets which wine glass is theirs and you end up with three times as many dishes at the end of the night. I'm going to leave a link to Dazzle It, Aluminum Wire, John Bead, and E6000 Glue in the description below. Thumbs up if you like this video. Leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press that notification bell so that you know I have a new video. Grab any one of my craft books for inspiration. I think you'll like The Big Ass Book of Home Decor and I will see you next week. Bye. I'm going to leave a link to John Bede and